Hey there, home athletes. Happy Tuesday. Workout for you today. We have a descending rep scheme of double dumbbell squat cleans, right? 10 all the way down through one. Uh, and then before each of those sets, we're going to form a 200 meter run today. I checked the forecast in advance. It's supposed to be dry on Tuesday. Hopefully that's the case when you're finding the time to do this workout. So get your run measured out, of course. You should probably have this done already, I'm imagining, for previous workouts. 200 meters, 100 meters down, 100 meters back. Should take about a minute or so, give or take. And then uh, we have that descending uh, rep scheme of squat cleans. So round one, you run 200 meters and then do 10 squat cleans. Second round, you run the nine squat cleans, run eight squat cleans. You get the idea. The very last thing we'll do today is a 200 meter run. Come back in and do one double dumbbell squat clean. Let me demonstrate for you. So obviously you need two dumbbells today. Let me get myself set up here. So we are doing squat cleans. The dumbbells are going to come from the floor. I'll demonstrate first. You touch the floor outside the feet. You jump straight up. Got those dumbbells on the shoulders. Full squat and stand. Do it again. Tap the floor. Straight up the shoulders. Squat and stand. We try to make the uh, dumbbells move vertically, right? Point the dumbbells down here. The dumbbell eye ideally comes straight up from the floor, goes straight to the shoulders. We catch and we squat. Try to use those legs and hips a lot to uh, get the dumbbells up to the shoulders as opposed to using the arms to pull. Talk about big jump. Put up the hips, catch, and stand. Hope you have a suitable weight for your dumbbells today at home. And then uh, running between. That's it. Should be a good workout. Plenty of runs today. Oh, and I forgot to mention this. So yeah, the runs are less frequent at the beginning of the workout. They become more frequent at the end of the workout, right? You're going to come back inside of your squat cleans, run, run, run. So there you go. Good amount of running today. Like short runs. Um, and then your extra credit today, a little core work. I did these, uh, or programmed these for you last week. The pike overs. So you have a dumbbell on the floor. Now in front of you, legs are straight. What are you doing? You're just basically lifting those legs, going up and over. If the hands are further back towards the hips and you're leaning back, this isn't too difficult. If you want to make it more difficult, move those hands forward down towards your knees, then all of a sudden, oh yeah, that's way more difficult. So you've got to play around with your hand position here. Further back, a little easier. Further forward, more challenging. But I want you to go over 30 times. So that's one, two, three, four, get the idea. Then work your back side a little bit, stay down on the floor, put the dumbbell on the front of the hips. This is where you do bridges. Heels down, dumbbell right here on top of the hips. Press up, squeeze it by the top, back down again. We're going to go ahead and accumulate 30 reps right there also. So three reps, 30 and 30 is going to be your finisher today. All right, boys and girls, thanks for tuning in. Have a great day, have a great workout, and I'll talk to you tomorrow.